FaZe K, a name we've all grown to love, lives with his other FaZe Clan members in a $10.5 million mansion, and this house used to belong to the famous Justin Bieber. So technically, these are these Justin are Bieber's, man. Yo, thank you, bro. They're insane. The monthly rent in this house is estimated to be $80,000. A lot of people are familiar with the rich kind of lifestyle he lives now, but few are familiar with the days before that. He created his YouTube channel in January of 2012 with the username Katricia. His real name is Fraser, and he grew up in London, England. Born in February 1996, making him a 24-year-old with Aquarius as his zodiac sign. K, along with being a famous YouTube star, is also a part and owner of the well-known gaming group known as FaZe Clan. It is worth noting that K did not form his clan, but joined FaZe Clan a few years after they were created. K is also an owner in the famous esports team. Let's talk about how it was. At the beginning, it was not well known by most of the people, but only a few people have knowledge about it. It would not be wrong to imply that it was an ordinary clan like many others that you could simply find by Googling. But the group got its fame after they started posting some of the best trickshotting and sniping montages on Call of Duty. K was introduced to the clan two years after its creation when the montages posted on his channel caught the attention of the leaders FaZe Temper and FaZe Banks. It can be seen by his YouTube posts that how happy joining the clan made him. Joining the clan came as a game changer for his life. His YouTube videos consisted of not only gaming, but he also started posting a variety of videos. The channel now consists of prank videos and challenge videos. Oh! <laughs> oh, what is that? Oh no, that's disgusting! K, in such a young age, has become an inspiration of millions of gamers out there. If K is not making videos, he is spending time relaxing on FaZe Clan's private backyard lake or collecting designer shoes, such as Gucci, Louis Vuitton, Givenchy, and many more. These brands can cost over $5,000 to $10,000 per item. Some of K's most expensive pieces include a $5,000 Louis Vuitton bag that was gifted to him by the Steelers wide receiver, Juju Smith-Schuster. FaZe K also has his own private house. House. Where to next? Um, Frazier's crib. We gotta show off Frazier's house. Listen, Frazier got his own house. Which is stacked to the roof with famous bear bricks that cost around 500 to 1,000 a piece. He's got his own kitchen. We got a girl in here cooking. You're living your best life, baby. <laughs> Takashi Murakami pillows, which should go to upwards of $600, and IKEA collaboration off-white rug that resells for almost $2,000. Oh my god, Frazier is so sweet, bro. Faze K's go-to brand is Gucci. His shoe collection shows a ton of different brands from Yeezys to Fendi. Although he normally wears off-white or Gucci slides that could cost around $200 to $400. Faze K. He has more than 4 million subscribers on YouTube alone. Having so many people following you can only be a dream for some people, but Frazier made it possible only at the age of 24. He is also famous for his dialogue that is insane, bro, and trust. Oh! Oh well, that was an insane grenade throw, bro. How did you get that? There we go. That was fire, man. What? A lot of memes are based on that single phrase. Along with his YouTube channels, he also earns most of the worth by different streams of revenue, including Instagram, sponsorships, and even by selling his own merch with his famous saying, trust on them. Trust. As well as having revenue come from YouTube and sponsorships. Today I'm making a laser obstacle course and at the end of it is going to be $10,000. Holy. What is going on? K also owns his own company called Heat. Heat is a company that sells designer clothes at half the cost. They specialize in selling mystery boxes that can hold up to thousands of dollars worth of designer clothes at just $300 per box. <laughs> Phase K's YouTube subscribers grew gradually between 2017 and 2020, with 1 million subscribers being earned November 16th, 2017, 2 million subscribers March 19th, 2019, 3 million subscribers July 12th, 2019, and 4 million subscribers February 14th, 2020. Three, two, one. But before K was a well-known YouTuber, he struggled for many years to get to where he is today. Phase K started making YouTube videos back in 2012 that mainly consisted of Call of Duty highlights. He started gaining attraction during his time in a clan called Optic Gaming. Optic Gaming was one of the top names in esports. K was considered a sniper and content creator for the team. During this time, K had become close with FaZe Banks. Banks eventually asked K to join FaZe after he saw potential in K. After many years, Frazier had finally made it. Guys, FaZe here and I'm 
We've had that in the back of the car and Brio. Sam, you will. The top team in esports and is able to play video games for a living, but he wasn't done yet. Eventually, Kay started making real life videos outside of gaming. These videos consisted of many different things, including buying the entire menu restaurant and trying to eat it all. Yeah, when I get out of one of everything for me. This is where Kay started getting attention and the views went up. Have you ever noticed why Rice Gum is featured in a lot of Frasier's videos? That's because FaZe K was once his assistant. The music video is, is done, mate. It's there's done, there's done. nothing left Yo, to I do. I just wanna say, the past week has been really stressful. This dude put me on the spot. I wasn't expecting that. Kay was sticking through the whole time, supporting me, man. Like, <laughs> no, go, go. <laughs> While working towards his dream, Kay was able to support himself by working closely with Rice Gum and being able to feature him in his videos. He saw a future looking up to people like Rice Gum, so he knew he had to do anything so he could stay in LA and make his dreams come true. Kay has not only shared his possessions with himself, he lives with his younger brother, Faze Jarvis. Alright, alright! I wasn't playing Fortnite, just just some other game, you know what I'm saying? I don't play Fortnite. But I just literally saw. And is able to help Jarvis by giving him challenges, and in reward, Jarvis can win different items of clothing or even loads of cash. Oh my, Jarvis, bro, they're Gucci socks, man. Come on, we can go target for this. Jarvis runs his own channel and has over 3 million subscribers and has a net worth of $3 million. Jarvis started appearing in Kay's videos in 2012. All right, me and my brother have decided to do a gamma challenge each and see who can complete it. <laughs> then he reappeared in Kay's videos during 2017 with a popular video game, Fortnite, just starting to gain attraction. Yo, I mean, you won a game in school. <laughs> Second dub in school. Yo, that is so lit, Jarvis. There you go. With the victory royale. Oh my god, this kid is a beast, that man. insane. If you guys are interested in seeing a whole video about Jarvis, make sure to like and comment on the video to let us know. Kay also has helped his now ex-girlfriend, Charlotte Parks, to get her start on YouTube. Wait, wait, you're gonna have to take over Charlotte. Charlotte, I'll get the piece of you play Fortnite. I'll get the piece of you play Fortnite. Charlotte has an estimated net worth of $1.1 million and is very popular on social media platform Instagram. Kay helped her get a start on her YouTube and helped boost her channel to have over 600,000 subscribers. Faze K is estimated online to have a net worth of $3.7 million, but that does not account for all the different streams of revenue he has, includes sponsorships, YouTube channels, Instagram posts, investments, other businesses, and more. Beyond spending money on designer clothes and props for videos, K is also heavily invested into the stock market, with hundreds if not millions in his portfolio. He also has set him and his brother Jarvis up for more than just a life on YouTube, while investing in money into houses and apartment complexes back in his home in the UK. Frazier is one of those people who likes to look different. In a room full of people, they like to be noticed. That makes it clear why he spends that much on his clothing items such as shoes, shirts, and hats. Look at this, this is a crew neck. Turn this around. I, don't, I get gas to close the case. I don't know if you're as hyped as me. I'm literally genuinely excited about this because I'm about to own this. This is so nice. Oh my Jarvis. Insane. You're like actually crazy. Kay also loves to be ink. That's why most of his body is covered in tattoos. His most famous tattoo is one of a tiger with his mouth open and a FaZe logo in it. He also has tattoos of smiley faces and the famous Rick and Morty that he got for videos on his personal channel. No way you have Rick and Morty on your leg, dude. Trust me. Most of his items have a FaZe Clan logo on them. It would not be wrong to say that FaZe lives an extraordinary life with an ordinary lifestyle. Kay's an ordinary boy from London who started his career as a YouTuber at the age of just 18 and soon after six years later becoming one of the most well-known and rich YouTubers. His growth has been consecutive in the years since his start and that defines his success. Along with dollars, he has also earned a lot of love from his followers who love watching him do his own created challenges and pranks he does mostly on his friends and also some with his brothers. <laughs> Kay is a well-reputed man with his success that speaks for itself. 
and he also is a great motivation for young YouTubers and gamers because all of his earnings are from online sources. Not to forget about his online store where he sells his merchandise, showing that he also has a good mind related to the business side of World Also.